His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa sent a cable to the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Salman and Abdul Aziz Al Saud of Saudi Arabia, expressing deep condolences after the demise of His Royal Highness Prince Abdul Rahman bin Abdul Aziz Al Saud, praying to Allah Almighty to rest his soul in eternal peace. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa also sent a cable to the custodian of the two holy mosques, expressing deep condolences over the demise of His Royal Highness Prince Abdul Rahman bin Abdul Aziz Al Saud, praying to Allah Almighty to rest his soul in eternal peace. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister sent a similar cable to the Saudi Crown Prince, Deputy Prime Minister and Minister of Defense, Prince Mohammed bin Salman bin Abdulaziz Al Saud. And His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman bin, Abla bin Hamad Al Khalifa sent a cable to the custodian of the two holy mosques expressing deep condolences over the demise of His Royal Highness Prince Abdul Rahman bin Abdul Aziz Al Saud, praying to Allah the Almighty to rest his soul in eternal peace. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince also sent a similar cable to the Saudi Crown Prince, Deputy Prime Minister and Minister of Defense. The vice chairman of the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club High Committee, Zainal Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, attended yesterday the 26th edition of the Bahrain Trophy Race at the Newmarket July Festival in the United Kingdom. The winner of this year's Bahrain Trophy Race was Raheen Haas, ridden by Jamie Spencer. In presenting the award, His Highness said that winning races at this level marks a horse as having exceptional ability and is an important factor in determining mining stud values. He also spoke of the thrilling atmosphere at the prestigious event steeped in royal equestrian history. His Highness Sheikh Isa is highly involved in the administration of the Royal Arabian Stables and supports Bahrain's leading role in the preservation of the Bahraini Arabian horses. His Royal Highness Sheikh Isa was accompanied by His Highness Sheikh Sultan al-Din bin Mohammed bin Salman al-Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Ali bin Isa al-Khalifa and the ambassador of the King Kingdom of Bahrain to the United Kingdom, Sheikh Fawaz bin Mohammed Al Khalifa. They attended a lunch banquet ahead of the race, organized by the Jockey Club as part of the festivities. Within the framework of the official visit to the United States of America, the Minister of the Interior, Lieutenant General Sheikh Rashid bin Abdullah Al Khalifa, met at the Pentagon the U.S. Secretary of Defense, James Mattis. The U.S. Secretary of Defense welcomed the minister, hailing the historical and strategic relations between the Kingdom of Bahrain and the United States. He also expressed appreciation for the role and political approach of the Kingdom of Bahrain under the leadership of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. The U.S. Secretary of Defense also to express appreciation to the Kingdom of Bahrain for hosting the headquarters of the U.S. 5th Fleet and the support and facilities provided to the United States, expressing his condemnation of Iranian interventions in the Kingdom of Bahrain and its attempts to destabilize its security. He also praised the efforts of the Ministry of Interior to maintain the security of citizens and residents of the Kingdom of Bahrain, expressing sincere condolences to the martyrs of the security men and condolences to their families. For his part, the Minister of Interior 
Interior praised the strategic relations between the two friendly countries. Present was the military attaché at the Embassy of the Kingdom of Bahrain in Washington.